Tonight, we have an Eyewitness News exclusive. The local vendor family attacked on Valentine's Day is speaking out tonight about their ordeal and the arrest of the suspect. Tonight, we have new images and video of the crime. CBS 47's Juanita Adame joins us live in studio with the story. Juanita. Well, Catherine, the sisters I spoke to told me their dad has worked for 30 years providing for his family, and when someone tried to take advantage of that, their first instinct was to fight back. These photos and a new angle on witness video show the chaos and the bruises left behind following a violent attack on a vendor and his daughters on Valentine's Day. He started just punching my sister. My sister, of course, she fought back. She started punching him back. Sisters Nana Luz Beltran, here on the right, and Elvia Cordova said the attack happened quickly and without warning. He grabbed the gift, he tried shoving it in the car. The gift was too big, so by this time my sister turned around and seen. They said the suspect, now identified as 21-year-old Martin Chavez, tried stealing their gifts when the family fought back, which then enraged him. My dad ran and he ended up punching my dad. He ended up stabbing my dad in his hand. With what, I have no idea. The ordeal left them shaken, but also thankful to those who stepped in and quickly had him identified. I thank the Fresno PD for being on this and um, for, for really stepping up and for the mainly the people, the community. Thank you for stepping up. They say it's important not only to stand up for their families, but their communities as well. My dad's just somebody who's trying to make a living. My sisters, you know, they help the family. And this was a very, very scary situation. Now, the other thing that the sisters have said is they wanted the public to know they have not set up a GoFundMe account. If you find one, do not donate to it because it does not belong to the family. Live in the studio, Juanita Adamas, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.